Welcome Virgo and cross watchers. This is your general love reading. Virgo, it looks like you are walking away from somebody who is deceptive with you or using um, almost like sex as a weapon with you um, to go back to a soulmate from your past. Um, it looks like you want to reconcile a broken heart and speak the truth about things. So stick around. Let's see where this goes. Virgo, I'm going to get into your energy and then I'm going to get into the energy of all 12 signs and I'll get you some Oracle cards and then we'll get into your spread. So with that, Holy Spirit, Angel Spirits and Guides, Clarity and Guidance for Virgo, please. What is Virgo's energy? What is Virgo's energy, please? What is Virgo's energy, please? Okay, you got the energy of a death card, which is an ending or a transformation. Um, so you're ending communication. You're cutting somebody off. Holy Spirit, Angel Spirits and Guides, Clarity and Guidance for Virgo. What is the energy of all 12 signs around Virgo, please? Starting with Aries. What is the energy around Aries, please? Okay, so Aries is something that's someone wants equal give and take and something long-term and committed. If you're dealing with a Taurus, Taurus is uh, being divinely guided to manifest a new beginning. Um, if you're dealing with a Gemini, somebody's being patient about a, having a new beginning. If you're dealing with a Cancer, someone's very guarded and defensive about a third party. If you're dealing with a Leo, someone's watching, wanting to offer. They're watching you offer somebody something or apologize to some, They're seeing you apologize or offer somebody something. If you're dealing with another Virgo, um, somebody's trying to make a decision about recovering, resting, taking a minute, you know, just figuring something out. But this is could be distance, could be resting, recovering from a heartbreak, could be overcoming um, healing feeling something you could be ill so they're making some kind of a decision or they're juggling I'm getting the decisions being made they need to balance their healing or they need to make a decision on how they rest and recover possibly if you're dealing with a Libra somebody's trying to understand something from a different mindset so they can move on if you're dealing with a Scorpio Somebody's getting clear about the mistakes of the past. If you're dealing with a Sagittarius, um, somebody wants to speak the truth about winning at all costs and mind games. If you're dealing with a Capricorn, somebody's in a new happy, could be a new sexual relationship. They're happy in this relationship. They're happy with a new idea or they're happy with a new beginning of passion. So however it resonates with you, somebody's happy about it. If you're dealing with an Aquarius, you have a relationship with their divine feminine. And if you are dealing with a Pisces, uh, someone wants to heal a, something with an X. Okay, so let's get into your Oracle cards. Virgo and see what comes up for you there. So keep in mind, Virgo, your energy is that you've decided to end communication with somebody. You're ending the communication. Holy Spirit, angel spirits and guides, clarity and guidance for Virgo, please. What does Virgo need to know? <clears throat> Got the devil card. Take care immediately to avoid temptation and deceit. You have the lion harness the loyal and protective aura of the lion and charge ahead magnificently. So they want, you see this temptation and you are just charging in the opposite direction. You're going the other way. This is maybe why you are ending communication with somebody. It's just like you're tired of it. You're tired of the deception and you're going to, charge ahead in another charge off in another direction and almost like fierce energy like you're pissed and you're done and you're not you're standing in your power 
patient, be patient here. Purity, purify, purity. So you need to clear your energy. Holy Spirit, angel, spirits and guides, clarity and guidance for Virgo, please. What does Virgo need to know, please? Lighten your load. Protection. See, you're protected. Whatever this is, you've got protection around you. So they want you to be patient. Clear your energy. Um, you know, lighten the load. Let, let go of things that don't serve you. Holy Spirit, angel, spirits and guides, clarity and guidance for Virgo, please. What does Virgo need to know? Your dreams need a practical plan and a new romantic cycle begins. So you may be planning on going back towards somebody else. Um, you are starting a new romantic cycle, but you need some kind of a plan. You need to uh, relax, be patient. You're protected. Lighten that load. Honoring path. And back and forth, you make trying to make a decision about what path you're supposed to be on at this time. You're trying to you're going back and forth in your head. You feel like that energy. You're you're being tempted to go back to what doesn't serve you versus going towards what does. Infinite infinite abundance. Okay, abundance is pouring into your life and stepping into your power. You are strong beyond measure. See, you're standing in your power here with this lion card. I felt that energy when I pulled that. So, Holy Spirit, Angel, Spirits and Guides, Clarity and Guidance for Virgo, please. Okay, the fourth chakra, Archangel Raphael, is about your heart chakra. You need to open your heart chakra to give and receive love, okay? You're going to have a victory opening that heart chakra, opening up to receiving that new romantic cycle coming towards you. You may have felt stuck in some kind of temptation, some kind of, I just heard sexual addiction possibly, or somebody's trying to entice you with sex, um, whatever that, whatever it is, I just heard, I just heard that enticing that uh, Holy Spirit, Angel Spirits and Guides, Clarity and Guidance for Virgo. What does Virgo need to know? Ascending, maybe ascending to a higher power or a higher level of commitment, ascending in commitment. So you may be taking it to another level with somebody. Holy Spirit, Angel Spirits and Guides, Clarity and Guidance. Or Virgo. Virgo, I think once you open your heart chakra, you have that victory here. You'll be ascending. You have a new romantic cycle. You'll be ascending to a commitment. You'll be taking it to the next level here. Stabbed in the back, broken heart, pain, separation, deception, shocking, atta shocking attack. That's what that temptation's about. That's what you're standing in your power about. So time, take time, uh, time. Need time, take time, end time cycles, time to heal and progress. So you need to heal from some kind of temptation you're standing in your power for, but you're going to open your heart chakra. You're going to have a victory. You're going to ascend to another level here. You are powerful and abundance is coming. Okay. You're back and forth about backwards or forward. What are you going to do? Are you going to go on your honoring path? New romantic cycle begins. Your your dreams need a practical plan. You got this. You're protected. Lighten your load. Don't take on so much. You got to clear your energy and be patient. Because you have I'm almost like look at how you're growling at the devil. You're not taking any more bullshit from this person. Whoever this is towards you, you're not taking it. Holy Spirit, Angel, Spirits and Guides, Clarity and Guides for Virgo, please. What does Virgo need to know? What does Virgo need to know, please? What does Virgo need to know? What does Virgo need to know here, please? 
Okay, you're looking at the past, the mistakes that were made, it has to do with heartbreak and you moving on to your two of cups. That's exactly what your oracle card said. Opening up that chakra to give and receive the greatest love of all, that two of cups energy. Moving towards your wish fulfillment with somebody from the past. That's why I felt that this is energy of somebody you know already. This, this person who's your true person, it, you know who this is. New passionate beginning in a relationship that you're going to heal. You're going to heal and because you've recovered. You've rested. You recovered from an option, illusion, something that was hidden. So, so somebody, somebody had that temptation over you, an illusion, an option, illusion. You have two illusions here, something that was a secret illusion, something that was hidden from you. Uh, they were hiding something or they made you feel like they were, yeah, they were, they were tempting you of some, some way. Okay. So you made a head over heart decision because you saw things clearly. You took the time to look at something differently and you want justice. And the outcome, you're coming in king of cups, a new beginning in love. Um, and you want to work and collaborate. Or third parties walking away, that's what that is. Because you've got that new love. The king of cups, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. He's mastered his emotions, but he can use your emotions against you. Okay? And, and he may self-medicate a little bit there. But he's got that cup in his hand and he wants to offer that cup. He's going to offer his cup to you. So there's a lot of love and emotion towards his true person. And this third party situation is over. He's walking away from the third party. So Holy Spirit, angel spirits and guides, clarity and guidance for Virgo. So you're looking at the past, the mistakes that were made, causes you a lot of anxiety. There's heartbreak. You want to reconcile with this person. You may have broken this person's heart in the past, and now you want to reconcile the heartbreak. Okay? You want to move forward. You want to move forward to somebody that you see is very grounded, solid, stable, dependable. This could be you, Virgo, or this could be your true match. Okay? So, moving forward to have, <clears throat> excuse me, some water real quick. your true match because it's a two of cups you had this person out in the cold needing to be patient you had this you broke their heart you want to recon reconcile this heartbreak because the two of cups was out in the cold being patient okay you want to move forward towards this person they're your wish fulfillment and you had to make that decision. This is that back and forth. Are you going to honor your path of your wish fulfillment? Or are you... <clears throat> You're stopping communication with somebody. And I'm thinking it's a karmic relationship or somebody from that you, you've had enough of this with. Okay? This isn't the soulmate. The soulmate is the one you're going towards. Because in the past, you breadcrumbed this person, your soulmate. You left them out in the cold, and now you want to rectify the heartbreak that you caused. And I'm saying it was caused by the Virgo. I do say it's caused by the Virgo. Um, but this person is your true match and could also be a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. It doesn't have to be, but they can be. Or it could be a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio. Okay, so new passionate beginning. And a lot of back and forth communication. I'm getting the, there's a lot of sex going on here. Like this is like the new passionate beginning and these wands are flying back and forth. Okay. So this is either a lot of communication about this new beginning of passion in a relationship. They're rushing in. See, I'm getting, there's a lot of sex going on in this relationship right now. Take it out resonates with you. But you know, I, I'm not getting that this is him being a player. I, I'm getting that he's rushing in ready to, ready to have, a lot of fun okay that's what I'm getting in this relationship he wants to heal he's coming in now he's going from the the um, knight of wands to the king of wands okay he's he's coming up he's wanting to heal this he's taking control he's standing in his power here he goes for what he wants he doesn't ask permission okay so he's there is a fight some kind of a fight there that took place the truth was spoken and he had to heal from that that truth, whatever that truth was that was spoken. 
about some kind of options with this queen of swords doesn't have to be a gemini libra aquarius but it can be okay so this is options illusion confusion this person was strategic about what they did they were very strategic about what they did and i got the in, in okay i said you could be dealing your true soulmate could be a cancer pisces or a scorpio some kind of illusion that they put around this person your soulmate so a secret about this person or this person there was an illusion around that person and you had to make a decision you were you're at a crossroads about this person and you had to make a decision and end something you had to end or transform you're ending the regret you're ending the regret because you're you're wanting to heal the heartbreak that's why you're ending the regret okay so you made a head over heart decision because you got real clear and you want justice you got real clear on something. It's taken you a long time to see the light. It's what I'm getting. So now you're going to come in and offer that cup. And you're going to have your happiness. Okay. But the king of cups is offering that cup. And the third party is walking away. Or that third party has walked away. Or he's walked away from the third party. Okay. So there is a walking away from a third party relationship. And having a victory. Moving forward. Moving forward. Um getting past the burden going from the rough waters to the calm waters where the burden was concerned he's going to be communicating passionate communicating queen of wands aries leo sag uh that he wants something long-term and committed there may not have been speaking because of the conflict i get that this queen of wands this is this isn't uh, somebody who's interfering as in this case this queen of wands is this this uh i'm surprised the empress hasn't come out because i'm feeling empress energy here i get that this queen of cups is this queen of wands here very passionate there's passion a lot of passion here you know he wants to communicate that he wants that passion and something long-term and committed they might not have been speaking because of the conflict that was caused and he wants to speak the truth virgo i'm going to take this into the extended i'm going to read you on one side i'm going to read your person on the other you can flip it switch it however it resonates with you i'll get clear i'll get more oracle cards and clarify your spread so with that if this resonates please leave me a comment down below don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you over in Vimeo for the extended.